Hi, right, so this is a quick workflow tutorial to show you how I save bookmarks into Notion and then gain access to the ability to quickly tag them and file them away. So what I do is outside of having a Notion account, there's an incredible Chrome extension called Save to Notion Web Clever and uh, it blows the official one out of the water because you have so much more access to certain fields within Notion. So for instance, I will click this here and um, you are driven to a database where you can create workflows for individual databases that you want to save things to. So this is what mine are. You also have the ability to um, highlight certain forms if you're using it consistently. So I would click on this and I go uh, set focus to form. This is unset focus, set focus, set focus to form. And then if I click on this uh, again, uh, it would then automatically load that form up. And I have it here where it's linked to a related data database, what day I've reviewed things on. And then here I've accessed the uh, tags inside that database. Um, you can also highlight and edit uh, what fields you want to include. Um, so by default it has, it will grab the uh, favicon, it will grab the front, front image, the URL, a description, and then the content of the article. But um, those are constants. In this case, I would highlight the variables. And so we want to do tags in this instance. So um, I'd say this is uh, video related. I already have one created for video. I tag that in there. Um, if there is a certain tag you know you are always using or you're on a certain project, you can make, again, a certain tag a constant. So it always kind of comes in and tags it accordingly. I'll add this to a new page. And then I can open up in Notion to see uh, how it's done. And uh, as you can see here, it's it's got this for cover image. So if you do use Notion and you would rather prefer to do like a card mode, uh, this is very handy to have that it takes a screen grab of that or the image. And here's the content of the article, which is very, very helpful. Uh, similar to, again, other web clippers. But uh, here you can see the tags are already listed as video. So I won't usually come to the page. Sometimes I'll just go to a page, I'll hit that, I'll quickly type in the, um, so he tells you also if you've saved it, which is handy because sometimes I return to pages. So that's nice to know. Uh, but come in here again and uh, just select all your tags and uh, of course you type in a few keywords and uh, it will automatically wheel things down. So uh, that's very helpful. But back in Notion, you will see that um, I have a uh, database here for all the articles and resources that I accumulate. And uh, here is my database of all the articles and tags associated with them. So of course from here you can filter which tags you want to see and sort, and it becomes a lot easier to search for things based on themes that you are aware of than it is to kind of traditionally go through bookmarks and scroll and scroll and scroll. So um, I highly, highly recommend this workflow. Uh, I can give a little more info if anybody is curious, please reach out, but uh, hopefully this is helpful.